President Museven finally broke his silence over the UN report implicating Uganda and Rwanda in the Congo crisis. Yesterday, while meeting the NRM members during the party caucus at State House in Tebe, the president for the first time rubbished the report and further issued an ultimatum, as the NRM caucus vice chairperson explains. Amateurs involved in the writing this report in investigations that actually the report we can submit as a heap of malignment. According to NRM caucus vice chairperson David Bahati, the president's argument was based on Uganda's peace initiatives in Africa. Uh, we, the, the president is still committed to the peace initiatives in the region on the condition that the, the UN stops uh, maligning our country. The UN recognizes the risk that we have taken in that country and also in other countries. Um, and we hope that when they, the Security Council considered considers the report on the 15th of this month, uh, that issue will be sorted out. Uganda is the current chair of the International Conference on the Great Lakes Region, and President Museven is leading a mediation effort for Diara Congo. Uganda's Minister for ICT, Ruhakana Ruguna, is already in New York, where he met the Deputy Secretary General and ambassadors from the 15-member UN Security Council to express outrage at the report. Meanwhile, during the caucus, the president also harmonized this position with the NRM legislators regarding their position in the oil bills. The party is in agreement that the minister should have control over the licensing of oil companies and that an oil company should be established instead of a cooperative. NRM also supports proposals that waste management be handled by a separate company. Maurice Chol, NTV.